Howdy everyone, I hope you're having an amazing day. I'm going to do my first simulator game. It is called Supermarket Simulator. I don't know if this is going to be any good. I've watched a lot of people play it and it looks pretty fun, so we're going to give it a try. You'll, you'll start with a small store and grow to an awesome supermarket. Start by purchasing goods and sell and place them into your shelves. Don't forget to set the prices with a profit to avoid bankruptcy. Have fun. Okay. The game looks really pretty, actually. I didn't expect it to look this good. It's early access right now, so a lot of stuff that normally would be in a game of sorts is not actually here oh bike can i ride it whips going by okay this is dude this is a pitiful supermarket order goods using your computer market okay so surely we should just buy one of everything right just one of every single item that's my guess at least these three dollars i can't even afford that dude i can't even afford that 93 dollars is insane uh we're gonna get rid of some stuff we're gonna buy just the top row cereal bread flour that's still too much, <laughs> dude. It's the cereal. The cereal is so expensive. Okay, we're going to get bread, flour, and pasta. That'll work. We'll do that. Purchase. Pick up the boxes that just arrived. So I got to go out here, pick up the boxes. See, I said I washed a little bit on this. So I know a little bit. And then you got to put the items on the shelf. So you got to open them up and place them. I can just hold left click. Okay. Now I got to throw the box away. Set the price of the product. Well, let me put my other stuff on the shelf first, and then we'll do that. I did not mean to put that on the bottom shelf. That's annoying. We could probably order one more item, actually. Let's order one more. Something under... We can do oil. I don't think we have oil. Yeah, we'll do oil. Purchase. Awesome. Okay, so I gotta set the prices of each item. So these are worth 99 cents. We're gonna set them at a dollar. We're gonna set everything in a round number, just to make it easier. We're gonna try to do a dollar there. We're gonna try to... We're just gonna make some money off this. Dollar fifty. That can stay. So it's like, you know what I mean? We'll do a dollar here. Okay, cool. Open the store. So I go up to the sign and click, click it. Yeah, it's open now. Tutorial, wait for your first customer. Howdy, ma'am. She's buying some pasta. She'll, what's she, bread? Some bread and pasta. Interact with the counter. So I gotta click the counter. Okay, scan the products by clicking. $2. That looks way more than $2 you got there, but I'll trust you. She needs change. Just a dollar worth of change. Am I good now? No, no, no. I'm giving her more change than she needs. Uh, oh, I can right click. Okay. How do I... Oh, space bar. Okay. Space bar. Okay. So yours is 250 to 50. This is pretty easy. Change. $17. $17 and change is insane. Thank you, sir. $2. That's more sense. We're making money, I think. I gotta perform 25 checkouts. Oh my. So I've seen you can get employees to scan stuff for you. So that's what we want. We want to get a cashier. There's a locked door right here. I've never seen that before. Hello, ma'am. Get out of this. Oh, I can get out. There we go. So I know if we go back, management. So we can buy these product license and these product license let us buy new stuff. So like unlocked ability to buy. The product license let us buy new food and stuff so like bottled water cheese dude <laughs> these people will not stop unless you buy new products and then there's bills we got to pay growth um so growth lets you expand your supermarket and make it bigger all the way golly there's so much hiring lets you hire cashiers storage lets you buy a place to store all your items like your stock your overstock i guess with each person that we uh serve we get XP, 5 SP, whatever that is, store points, I guess, 5 SP store points, I get 5 store points per, and it levels me up, and as I level up, I'll be able to buy new cool stuff and stuff like that. Oh, there's customization coming soon, so this game is in early access, so a lot of this stuff isn't out yet. There's a bank, too. I can take a loan? Should I just take a huge loan out? Just say screw it. $49 and change! So I'm guessing the game's gonna pick up the pace. It feels really, really slow right now. It feels very, very slow. Oh, I'm out of flour. I gotta buy more flour. Let me buy more flour. I'm out of flour. All right, we stop back up. So should we do two different products? So like, should we do pasta and pasta or should we do pasta and then something else? What would be the smart thing to do there? Do I need anything else? I kinda need more pasta. Watch, she's gonna buy the pasta. And then I'm really gonna need pasta. No, maybe not. Those cars are so loud when they go by. You didn't bought all the oil and bread. What are you making? There goes the. Oh no, all my pasta's gone. Hang on, sir. I need to order more pasta. 
Forty-eight dollars and change. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Like, just that's insane. Why are you just why are you breaking a hundred over here or whatever? Okay, cool. We got the pasta back up. Why does that do walking like that? So the bathroom's over there. That's seventy-two. What if I just charge him more? What if I just charged him like that? What happens if I do that? Ah, oh, it won't let me. Okay. <laughs> I thought I found a. Uh... Oh shit! My power's out. What? They're not paying the bills. Okay, we gotta flip the switch on. I didn't realize that. It's okay. God, everybody's coming through now. What are we out of? Oh man, we're out of bread. Uh, what else are we out of? So we're out of all olive oil. Oh, we can't buy more olive oil. Why is that? I don't feel like I'm making money. It doesn't feel like I'm making money. Should I raise the prices? I think I'm gonna raise the prices before I open the store tomorrow because I don't feel like I'm making money. Objective is perform 25 checkouts and it wants me to end the day, but I need two more. Surely two more people will come to the store before the end of the night, right? I don't want to end the day yet. I want two more customers. Okay, so I don't think any more customers are going to come, so I got to end the day. I don't think the game's going to let me. I need literally two more. Oh, it gives you a little daily statistics. Did I earn money? I lost $30. Yeah, I knew I wasn't making money. Your daily expenses. You'll receive daily bills starting today. Make sure to pay the bills using your computer before the due date or they'll get paid automatically. The more electronic devices you have in your shop, the more bills. Okay. I see that. I see that. The more electronics I have, the more expensive my power bill will be. Yeah, we're raising the price of everything. We can't have this. We need flour. We need olive oil. Okay, we can't afford both. We're just getting flour for now. So we need flour more. And we are going to raise the price of everything. Because we are not making enough money right now. We're going to go like 50 cents over. So like if you stop here, you're going to pay an extra 50 cents. Oh yeah, see right here is profit. Wait, market price 312. Wait, should, should I do three? 312. Oh, that's how much it is average in other places. Okay, I see. So like in the in the grocery store down the road, it's the average is 312. Like I said, that so we'll do $3 even. No we weren't making profit. That was our problem. Hey, look, now we're making $2 profit. We was making one cent profit. No wonder we was losing money. I see now. This is this one's three also. We'll do 350. Cool. Yes, yeah, yeah, see that that was our problem. That was literally our problem. 396. We're doing $4. Olive oil. 450 is average. We'll do 450. Okay, now we're actually making money. Cool. Dude, we, we was selling stuff for like... We was making no profit. We was breaking one cent even. We was literally making one extra cent on most of our products. We was doing charity work out here. And I don't know how I feel about charity, but... Oh, the lights look so much better. Charity's great, I'm joking. Is that Trevor? That looked like Trevor. Oh, see, now we're making money. Nine dollars? Dude, profit. Oh my, 13 bucks. Yeah, see, that, that that was our problem. That was literally our problem. Purchase product license using your computer. Okay, so the game wants me to purchase the first product license. Let's see. $200. What do I get from that? I get a bottle of water, cheese, coffee beans, eggs, milk, and tea. So I'm going to need a refrigerator because you can't keep cheese and milk on the cabinets. Yeah, I'm going to have to get a I'm going to have to get a refrigerator. How much is a refrigerator? I can't wait to hire someone to do this for me. I feel like they'd be so much faster than me. Surely. How much is a refrigerator? We do need one now. Storage. Nope. How do I How much is a cashier? Level 10. I'm only level 2. Oh my. Furniture, here we go. We need a refrigerator. $200. Let's 
I don't even that fridge is so small too. I can get a double one for like three seventy five. Maybe it's worth to save up because it's double for twenty five cheaper. So it's like double the size for like twenty five less. So maybe it's worth saving up for that one. Or maybe I should just get the the proper little one. There's also freezers. There's small racks. I could buy another checkout counter. I could buy a spotlight. I guess that's for the roof, right? Yeah. Do you buy more olive oil? That olive oil kind of looks like a bottle of pineapple juice, if I'm being honest. Have you ever seen them bottles of uh, pineapple juice that look very eerily similar to that olive oil? But $47 and change. Y'all people are just out here wild. And everyone in the area is like, oh, yeah, that's still, that, they, uh, that market down the road, they'll break your hundreds. They'll break your fifties. And they come down here and buy one thing. And then olive oil and bread. We're making croutons. Pasta and olive oil. I got to purchase a license. I don't have enough. I have $109. Thank you for coming to my shop, ma'am. I appreciate it. You got to support local businesses, you know. It's the only right thing to do, man. I feel like my... If anyone in the comments have any tips on how to make my store look better... I need more pasta. If anyone has any tips on how to make my store look better, please let me know. Because I'm not no interior designer. So I would appreciate all the help. Oh, I can't buy after 9pm. It's too late. I literally have to end the day. I have no choice. We'll purchase our stuff in the morning. We, have, we made profit today. See, yesterday we didn't make profit. Today we made profit. $158 profit. That's pretty good. Oh, look how they, they stack these boxes so neatly. I wonder who, whoever works at that Amazon delivery or whatever company it may be, they need a raise. They actually know how to properly, st like, not destroy the product when it's delivered. So when we have extra, I think we can place the box down. G. Yeah. We'll just stack our overstock right here. I'm going to buy one more box of flour just so I can make it look, you know, present more presentable. Even though I really don't need it, but I want it to look good. It's the storage. I think eventually we can buy this and then we can store like, see like this box, we can store it in there basically is what it's for, I think. For now though, we're just going to put them in the floor because it's more convenient anyways, probably. <laughs> What's the guy from Zombieland? It, it talks about Winkies all the time. He looks like him. Right here. Cereal. No, they're... Dude, they are literally... Since I didn't set a price, the dude just took it. He thinks it's free. It's not free. Six dollars. Because y'all made me order this. I gotta make my money back from the dude that just stole from me. You can't just, dude, no. Look, dollar fifteen. That's not how much a cereal are. You, you thief. You were literally a thief. You're so lucky. I can't call the police. I don't have a cell phone. I can't afford one. So it seems that people get upset when you have items but don't have them here. Like even if, even if you haven't ordered them ever, they still get upset about it. So I think I need to. I think I need to save up enough for a refrigerator too before I buy a license because I still can't order. Because I still can't put the items in the refrigerator, and then people are going to complain about it because they don't. I don't have the items. I can't put eggs on a shelf. Like, I mean, I can, but I don't know if that's. I might get shut down by like food services or something. 297. Okay. I think we're going to end the day there. And next episode, we're going to buy this product license. And then we're going to buy the. Oh, my bills. Okay. We paid our bills. So next episode, we're going to buy the product license. And then we're going to buy the. After we buy the product license, we're going to buy the refrigerator unit. Probably refrigerator B, maybe just refrigerator A, because it's not a lot of items. It's like two items that need to go in the refrigerator, so I think refrigerator A will work. Yes, and then we're going to buy the new products and stock them. Okay, let's end the day. Boom, how much money do we make? 155, 304 in our balance. That is awesome. We made all, we $291 in income. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Stay tuned for next episode. Next episode, we're going to get the license for the refrigerator products, and we're going to buy a refrigerator and put it like right here. Y'all have any recommendations to make this look less bad? Let me know. I'll see you next time. Peace out.
Can I get you a drink? <laughs> blame it on the Henny, blame it on the goose. Got you feeling dizzy. Blame it on the a a a a alcohol. Blame it on the a a a. Yeah, cause I got it like that. Flow so smooth, like I got it on tap. Yeah, and I'ma say it be a good night while I'm on my yingling, while I'm drinking Bud Light. Uh, can you get it when you miss me? Like I'm with whiskey, drinking Jim Beam. Yeah, baby.